Oh, there's the problem. About four years ago, I got called for a recovery up here on the mountain. Um, a guy had slid off the road and he said there's a Jeep at the bottom of the hill. So I came out here and I got the guy out. Sure enough, there was a Jeep rolled over in the bottom of this ravine. There it is, way down there. And I've already talked with the Forest Service. They've already approved me. Whatever we need to get in here, get the job done and get out. So today's the big day. We are heading up to get the JL off of the mountain. I'm so great at naming things. So this is Operation Go Get the JL Off the Mountain. We're getting loaded up. We've got a few more things to grab. Then we're going to go get drinks and fuel and all that and head up. Um, so we'll do an update at the trailhead. We got some goods. This water. It's from a tropical island. It's pretty incredible. We got chips. We got cheese. It's gonna be a good day. What'd you get, Sean? You can do it like all the Sandwich, same shit, but water. faster. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Energy. Need energy. Yeah. This is all the damage um, from the floods last year after the fire the year before. The Pat Creek fire came through here and wiped out most of this hillside. The vegetation holds the ground in place. So when a fire comes through and burns it out, there's nothing to hold everything and the water just rages off of here. The fire just barely missed the Jeep, right? It just missed it by about a ridge line. the door yeah yeah and then instead of grabbing the key i grab this grab the other thing and then go okay i think i got everything shut the door and then go ah. <laughs> should we do it now or should we do it later we'll do it later all right it's more fun later yeah it's more fun <laughs> all right so here we are we're at the trailhead for LaSalle pass so a little backstory on this this jeep um i've been seeing in the comment section this is not an insurance scam. This is not anything like that. So the vehicle slid off the road. They tried to self recover. Things went bad and it tumbled down the hill. Insurance company tried to find somebody to get it. And plus it has to work with the forest service and everything. We were contacted because of our off road, because of what we do and how we do it and everything. And we work well with the BLM, with the forest service, with everybody. So yeah, we're going to head in. We're going to get set up up above there. We're taking the trailer because there's a lot of parts from when it tumbled down scattered everywhere so we're going to clean up all that trash there's a four-wheeler up there we're gonna we've got some traffic cones we're gonna block off there there's not much traffic that's why we came in the middle of the week so we shouldn't really see anybody but it, it's a really tight road with very minimal turnaround areas so we don't want to we don't want to have a bunch of people coming in causing more off-trail traffic so 
here we go. Caution. Good yellow case. Yellow. Official business.
Oh, this is the world's finest chainsaw. It is a MS-170. Sometimes it even runs. I want to see the one where. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> I'm going to get you. <laughs> First and foremost, we need to get tools, control arms down there to start putting that back together. Okay. Anyway, like I said, my plan is that tree right there is going to be our main pull point. Okay. Just snatch off of that and... Yeah, so we're going to go right through those trees to the Jeep and then down to the Jeep and back with our snatch block. Okay. And pull it up until I'm hoping we can get it right here. But when we get it up to that tree where we're done pulling, yeah. then I wanna put the wrecker right here. Yeah. With the anchors and use the rear winch to drag it up, not the pick winch, but just the rear winch. Yep. Pull it up into right here. And then hopefully we can, then we can dig the wrecker around, get right there and then drag it up right through that little wash. Okay up to there and then take it out I but see it. first and foremost let's get some control arms together okay all right here we are walking down find us a jeep oh that is the problem front fell off Such is the way. Oh, somebody stole the Jeep emblem. Damn. Where it flew off as it cartwheeled down the hill. We are looking at it, the rear shocks are missing. Yeah, rear shocks. So somebody came down here and took the front bumper and the winch off, the rear shocks, and the stereo. Like, I'm winded walking down here. I wonder why they didn't take the front shock. Of course, I may be kind of out of shape. Well, that one's kind of bent. Oh. Very bent. They left a bolt for the bumper, so. Oh, sweet. That's nice. Yeah, you don't want to litter. Right <laughs> you don't want to litter. How'd it work, Mike? Pretty good. I got 10, I got 7 eighths, and another 7 eighths. A soft shackle, kind of hard shackle on here. The soft shackle is to hook onto the Jeep. The hard shackle is for weight in throwing this because we're going to try and get it down the hill to Sean so that we can winch the Jeep onto its wheels. Sean! Where are you at? By the big pine tree! Move your arms! I see a bush kind of moving. Here, let me move it. You see anything? Yeah, kinda. Let me move the bigger one, hold on. See it? Yeah. Right in that area. All right. Get 
Not even close. Not even close. You see that juniper up above that pine? Yeah. Yeah, it's next to that. Okay. I made it. All the way up there. It's Rory. I gotta take this winch line extension down to that tree, not this one. That one. So I'll just go straight down, throw as far as I can, and then take it from there. Loop it up. Just like so. I threw it again. I don't know if you can see it. I'm gonna try to go through here and come back over. Almost there. Here's the end of the winch. Finally, let's throw it one more time. I am right by the juniper tree. All right, are you looking up? Yeah. Okay, keep an eye out for incoming. Okay. Yes, dude. Like five feet away from me. Perfect. Oh. Got it. That goes all the way up to the Jeep. Come down to this tree, snatch block. down to that tree right there. That's where my key is. All right, I'm gonna take, I got three of these, two of those, two of those. Yeah, we got plenty extra up here too. I haven't touched that, so that's still wound up like you had. Oh, it's fine, whatever it is. <laughs> <laughs> Made it to the tree. There's a winch line extension, snatch block, tree saver, hatchet. So, I'll wrap it around this tree and go that way. So winch extension is going to run down, go to that big pine tree and go over. And this is the pole that's going to put the Jeep on its wheels. Not, not until the axle is connected, but we're trying to get this done while Mike's working on getting the axle in because in all my preparation, I forgot to come along. No? No. Okay, I got this one on there and I got this one on there, but none of which are attached to the axle. Right. What do you we think about if forward. we hooked our winch line to this axle and pull it away, I bet we could get this upper in place? Lower. Or, well, yeah, currently. currently it's an upper lower. right now. It's, a, it's an up, temporary upper. Let me see that, the winch line. Go right around. Right, Chero? Yeah. Back here, Right? How's that look, honey? Uh, that's doing good things. Okay, let's hold there for a moment. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, what do you think if we rearrange, set up a snatch block like off the rear axle to pull this one down in?
Thank you, sir. Ha! Okay, Rory, go ahead and reel the winch in. All right, she's moving, it's coming. Yep. Okay, hold up there. Okay, a little more winch. Okay, stop. Ready? Yep. Oh, oh. god dang it. Okay, we're close. Got it. The upper? You have another upper? Oh, uh, right behind you. Okay, so this was, which one? This guy, right? Maybe somehow. Uh, I think if we move the winch here. Yeah? It should pull. Well, it's gonna pull that way. stop when that shock limits, right? Got it, okay. Um, go ahead and put a little tension on the winch. Oh, oh, hold. Mango. Okay, we got it free. Okay, I got it hooked to the, the roll bar, center of the roll bar. Um, go ahead, put some tension on it. Okay, uh, I say go ahead, pull it. Okay, it's starting to creep. It's moving a little. Switching, okay, here it's starting to come. It's moving. He's moving. He's at about 20 degrees, 30, 45. He's about to go over. And there it is. Okay. Woo! Wow. <laughs> nah. Oh. Oh, look. There's a mouse. Uh, just come running out of. He was living in there. Um, I think we should regroup over to the, the a B pillar. I think we're gonna rehook over here and tip it up so that this tire comes off the ground and we can put a fresh tire on there. Keep going. Alright, that ought to work. Yeah. What are you looking for, Mikey? It's a, a lug nut key for the take a special splined lug nut key to take those off. Oh, it could yeah, be. I started like <laughs> right here. <laughs> oh yeah, look at it. It just kept going and going and going. <laughs> kind of hit right here, and I was like, um, I really you don't sure you need any more. I'm like, yeah, an eighth of an inch. <laughs> the winch line started over here. And just, yeah, yeah, and then I was like all. mowing down. You're like, keep going. I'm like, how much till it starts pulling? You could hear the winch slowing down. 
And it wasn't even tight on our end. Mm -hmm. Mikey got uh, it was, he, it was, he, it was nachos when I was pulling it dead through there because it was hanging up from Taco the Bell. Brush. Yeah, we got chips and cheese. And cheese from Taco Bell. That's queso. Queso. Queso, it's Spanish cheese. <laughs> It's half of a house sandwich. Look at that. What possessed you to cut it that way? <laughs> That's how you do it. You're supposed to do it that way all down the time. Down the middle, right? Yeah, right down the middle. Split it right in half. Yeah, if you cut it the other way, then somebody gets the heel. Yeah. Right. Or the booty, or whatever they call it. Yeah, so. Divorce bread. <laughs> whatever you call it. What, what do you guys call it? Comment. <laughs> Let me know. <laughs> the, you know, the end of the loaf of the bread or the like the ends of it. What do you guys call that? Always heard it growing up, the worst bread. Do you like it? <laughs> yeah, it's the best part. Do you like well, the worst yeah. bread? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, some mayonnaise. Oh, what? We have mayo? No, I ate it all. Oh. <laughs> I haven't taken one bite yet. <laughs> Okay. Take five ways. Oh, there you go. So this is what keeps happening. Great. Okay, turn driver a little. Right there. Okay, perfect. Keep it there. Come on, Tammy Hawk. Tammy Hawk, yeah. Thumbs up. How? 